For this tutorial I'm going to be doing another collaboration and this one's based on Effie Trinket so Simple Little Pleasures is going to be doing a nail tutorial inspired by the clothes that Effie wore and I'm going to be doing the makeup which is very much a recreation from many of the pictures that I've seen online so far. If you've got dark eyebrows like me what you're going to want to do is get a cream concealer and taking a mascara wand you're going to take this and you're going to brush this through your eyebrows and what this will do is lighten up your eyebrows and you want to brush up, down, sideways, really get this all over the lashes not just on the surface, just to lighten them. Obviously if you've got blonde eyebrows you're not going to really need to do this step but it is a good step to do if you've got darker eyebrows and you want to really imitate Effie's look. Once you've applied it all over the brows, blend out the edges and now taking primer we're going to apply this anywhere that we'll be applying eyeshadow. Blend out the primer either with your fingers or a brush and now taking a light violet shade we're going to apply this all over the lid and blend it. Mixing two shades of pink from the 120 palette, I'm going to take this and we're actually going to be working this on the lower lid and also on the cheekbones. If you're finding a smaller brush a little bit too time consuming, take something like a blush brush and use this to apply the pink all along the sides of the face and then take the smaller brush again to blend the colour underneath the eye. If you haven't done so already, take the violet colour that we used first and blend it all the way up into the eyebrow and make sure that you blend this with the two colours that we've applied on the lower lid. If you find the fluffy blending brush a little bit too difficult to work on the lower lid, get something like a flat shader brush and use this to blend it into the lower lid. Now taking some black cream eyeliner, I'm going to line the eye. With whatever's left on the brush we're going to take this and we're going to line the lower waterline but keeping it as close to the lashes as possible. Take a baked shimmery white eyeshadow and really apply this heavily in the inner corner of the eye and make sure that you blend this with the colours on the upper and the lower lid. For the eyelashes I want to go with something quite natural because even though Effie's look is quite extreme the eyelashes aren't too extreme so you want to go with something which is fairly natural and then apply a lot of mascara on the lower lashes. The lips is probably the trickiest part of this whole look. You want three colours. You want a white, a blue and a pink. And taking quite a bit of white, we're going to mix a little bit of pink and a little bit of blue together. Mix these together. And then if you think that this colour is still a bit too dark, take a little bit more of the white and mix it in until you get a kind of sickly violet colour. the colour we've just mixed all over the lips. Make sure that you apply a really good thick coat, we don't want any of the natural lip colour to show through. Take a cotton pad and you're going to wipe away the outer corners of the lips. And now going back to the mixing board we're going to take the blue and we're going to mute it so that it's a little bit more of a pale light blue colour. Now with an eyeliner brush or a lip brush, you're going to line the outer corner of your lips. Taking the lip brush that I used for the first colour, I'm going to blend it in just slightly. I don't want too much of a contrast between the two colours. Finish off with a curly blonde wig, any kind of flower in your hair, preferably black, pink or red. Apply rhinestone with lash glue as a beauty spot. And that's it. You're done.